Literature and Journalism in World War II, The English Voice in Trying Times. Hello, dear learners. Today, we're diving deep into an intriguing topic, literature and journalism during World War II. This era witnessed a rich tapestry of English works that not only documented the tumultuous events but also shaped the language itself. Let's explore how writers and journalists use the English language to convey the hopes, fears, and realities of this global conflict. During World War II, journalism played a pivotal role in keeping populations informed. War correspondents traveled with troops, often risking their lives to report on the front lines. They provided first-hand accounts of battles, victories, and losses. Ernie Pyle, an American journalist, was one such figure. He was known for his human interest stories, focusing on the ordinary soldier rather than the larger strategies of the war. Through his words, readers got a real sense of what the everyday serviceman experienced. World War II was not just fought with weapons but also with words. Many authors used their writings as a form of resistance against the enemy or to reflect on the horrors of war. English writer George Orwell, for instance, penned the allegorical novel Animal Farm during this period, critiquing totalitarian regimes. While the book is set on a farm, the implications about the dangers of absolute power were clear. Similarly, British author Graham Greene explored the morality of war in his novels, questioning the dichotomies of right and wrong in a world at conflict. Poetry became an intimate way to express the emotional turmoil of the war. Many soldiers and civilians alike took to poetry to articulate their feelings. One prominent figure was Keith Douglas, a British poet and soldier. His poems provided vivid images of the battlefield, highlighting both the brutality and fleeting moments of beauty. Beyond poetry, personal narratives, including diaries and letters, offer a window into the daily lives and emotions of individuals during the war. The Diary of Anne Frank, a Jewish teenager hiding from the Nazis, is one of the most poignant examples. From the trenches to the home front, literature and journalism during World War II captured the spirit, pain, and resilience of a world at war. These works not only shaped the English language but also provided invaluable insights into the human experience during one of history's most challenging periods. We hope this video has given you a deeper appreciation for the role of English in documenting and reflecting upon our shared history. Happy learning!